The Envoy as metered has the ability to perform revenue grade metering as well as consumption monitoring using current transformers or CTs. In this video, we'll walk through the installation of your production CT. Before installing the production CT, complete the following steps. Step 1. Download Installer Toolkit. Step 2. Verify that you have a production CT. Let's walk through these steps in more detail now. Step 1. Download Installer Toolkit. Before you travel to the job site, download the Installer Toolkit mobile app to your iOS or Android device and log in to Installer Toolkit with your Enlightened email account and password. Step 2. Verify that you have a production CT. The production CT is included with the Envoy S metered and is pre-installed in the AC combiner box. The production CT looks like this. If you are using the Enphase AC Combiner Box, the production CT is pre-installed. AC Combiner Box users can forward to the toolkit portion of this video to learn how to verify that production metering values are displayed in Installer Toolkit. If you are not using an AC Combiner Box, please continue through this video. You have now completed preparations and are ready to begin the production CT installation process. Before installing the CT, always de-energize the load center to reduce the risk of electrical shock. Be cautious. The line side of the main breaker will remain energized when the main breaker is off. Create a protected route using conduit for the CT wires from the main load center to the Envoy S. Use only the production CT that came with the Envoy S. This is important because the CT is paired and calibrated to the Envoy at the factory. The production CT is also marked with the same serial number as the Envoy S. Locate the arrow on the CT label. When the CT is installed, the arrow needs to be facing toward the loads. Install the CT on line 1 of the solar production circuit with the arrow pointing toward the loads. Connect the white wire to the IA dot terminal. Connect the blue wire to the IB dot terminal. Close and secure the Envoy S terminal block door. Turn on the circuit feeding the Envoy S. This will initiate the power-up sequence. At this point, you will use Installer Toolkit to connect to the Envoy via AP mode and verify system installation. If you are not familiar with how to do this, please pause this video now and view the following two short videos on Enphase.com before proceeding. The first one is, connect to the Envoy using Installer Toolkit on your Android device. Note that this video is available for both Android and iOS devices. The second video that you need to view is, commission your site using Installer Toolkit. Once you have viewed both of these videos, you can continue through this video. Make sure that you have enabled AP mode on the Envoy, connected to the Envoy's network, logged into Installer Toolkit, and clicked on Connect to an Envoy before continuing through this video. Once you have used Installer Toolkit to connect to the Envoy, tap Meters. Check the icon to the left of Production Meter. If you see a check mark, it means the meter is enabled. If you see this symbol, it means that the wiring is incorrect. Refer to the Envoy Help within Installer Toolkit for troubleshooting information. You can access Envoy Help by tapping on the App menu, tapping Help, and then selecting the topic of your choice. Return to the Envoy Overview screen and verify that the latest production reading lists positive power. The production meter data updates every 60 seconds. You can view production and consumption data from Installer Toolkit as long as the mobile device and Envoy S are paired in AP mode. For additional setup and troubleshooting information, please reference the Envoy S Installation and Operation Manual on Enphase.com, as well as the Envoy Help within Installer Toolkit. For additional training videos, please go to Enphase.com.